Today, I'll be blowing up TNTs from level 1 to level 100. This is the level 1 TNT. It's not very impressive. But this is the level 100 TNT that I'll be exploding at the end of today's video. Stick around to see that one. So guys, my cow Bessie gave me tons of TNTs. There's literally 100 different levels of TNTs. We already blew up level 1. That was kind of garbage. The level 2 TNT is called TNT times 5. Let's test this out. Oh my gosh. And that was only level two. Imagine what level 100 is going to be like. Level three is called fire TNT. It has some pretty cool particle effects going on. It just set everything on fire. I probably should have guessed that. Imagine how many pieces of bacon you could burn on there. Why use your imagination when we could just make it a reality? <laughs> The level 4 TNT is called Flat TNT, and I think this would be pretty good to use on top of my mountain. I always thought it was a little bit too bulky, so yeah, this flattened it out pretty well. Level 5 is called TNT times 20. The level 2 was times 5 TNT. Times 20 is going to be literally four times as big. Um, that was underwhelming. Even this sheep over here isn't impressed. The next TNT is called Sphere TNT. If I had to put money on it, this is probably going to create a giant circle of explosion. That's actually pretty good. Coming up next is going to be Farming TNT. Now, I don't really have a farm in my world, so I'm thinking that if we put one right next to this inconspicuous bunny rabbit, we can actually have a farm. And it looks like there's all different colors, so maybe we can have all different sorts of crops. I think it actually worked. Look, we got potatoes, we got beetroots, we got more potatoes. Take my potato, sheep. I'm excited for this next one. It's it's called gravity TNT. We're gonna use it next to these sheep. Just going to add a couple of more sheep, don't mind me. All right, that looks good. Here we go, three, two, one, gravity TNT. Oh my gosh, yo! That is definitely one way to kill an entire herd of animals. So guys, I had a really good idea. I spawned in tons of creepers, and what I'm gonna do now is place down the gravity TNT, and we're gonna explode it and see just how many creepers it'll suck up. Let's see what happens. Oh my gosh, that is insane. It makes them think that they're just gonna keep going up and down, but no, it explodes, and then it, everything just dies. That's easily the craziest TNT that we've seen today, but it is nothing compared to the level 100 TNT that you'll see at the end of today's video. Well, if you ever needed a drill in Minecraft, now we have the drill TNT, which is the next level of TNT that we're going to be testing out. Let's see exactly. Oh, all right. Yeah, that's, uh, that's, that did the job. Holy smokes. It went all the way down to bedrock. That is one effective TNT. And now that we have a giant drill, what we can do is place down the level 10 TNT, which is x-ray vision TNT. I have a weird feeling this is going to just turn the entire area into glass. And you could use it with the drilling TNT so that now I can see every single ore in this huge radius. And that's a useful TNT. And now that we have access to all of these ores, we could use the next level TNT, the firework TNT. Hopefully, oh, it rains TNT everywhere. The next TNT is kind of confusing. It is called walking TNT. I don't know exactly what this is going to do, but we're gonna find out. What kind of weird TNT is called walking TNT? That didn't really do much. What happens if I do it in survival mode? I'm thinking maybe it's like a TNT that'll chase you or not. This one is called Spiral TNT. It's floating up into the sky right now and it is shooting out TNT everywhere. Okay, it didn't shoot out that much TNT, but it was just enough to blow up the front of my house. And now we can test out this very strange looking TNT. It's called Swap TNT. I don't know if this is going to swap other TNTs or if it's going to to swap me with something else. Dude, wait, it's swapping every single mob in the area. It just started teleporting us like we were Endermen. Even Bessie got teleported. TNT number 15 is one of my favorite TNTs. It's called Troll TNT. Yeah, so Troll TNT actually just like doesn't have any fuse whatsoever. As soon as you touch it, it explodes. So there's no way to get away from this TNT. You see, let's say that this creeper is one of your best friends and you punch them. They try to come back after you. Come here, bud. There you go. And he immediately explodes because the Troll 
TNT has no fuse at all. Or if that doesn't do the trick, there's also another TNT in here, level 16, that's called Airstrike. Let's just keep our eye to the sky. Holy smokes! This TNT is raining missiles from the sky right now. The TNTs are definitely getting way more intense. My house is still standing, which means that we need more TNT. And what better to use than a TNT literally called the Pumpkin Bomb? Let's see what this bad boy does. Oh, what? Wait, did that drop candy? Oh my gosh, it did. It drops candy that gives you night vision, absorption two, and water breathing. And it spawned in a pumpkin. I think you guys are probably going to like this next TNT. The texture pretty much speaks for itself. This is called inverted TNT. Anything that it explodes, I'm pretty sure it flips upside down. It took the entire chunk that was down low and then brought it up here. This place is starting to look like a mess. I think we can make it look even more like a mess. We're gonna go ahead and use this TNT, which is called static TNT. I don't even have any guess of what that could do. It blew up one single block. Unless I'm missing something, that was literally worse than the level one TNT. I have a TNT that should do a little bit more damage and that is TNT times 100. I wonder why it's orange. I'm not really sure, but it's going to be literally 100 times that of the level one TNT that we spawned in at the start of today's episode. Oh my god! My house is gone! We're like not even halfway through to level 50. The next TNT we are testing out on this entire herd of Mama Lama Jamas. It's called Withering TNT. Oh my gosh. It killed all the Mama Lama Jamas and then replaced them with Wither Skeletons. We're gonna combat this by using the next TNT called Reaction TNT. My brain tries to figure out what the TNT is going to be before it explodes, but this one, I, I oh my gosh. I honestly had no clue what this would be. It is deleting everything. And it's not even like it was exploding it. It was just glitching out and deleting chunks after chunks below that reaction TNT block. I have a feeling I'll like this next TNT. It's called Animal TNT. And I don't know about you guys, but I am a big fan of animals. That is not an animal. That is a giant. Oh, guys, look, we got pandas. If you like pandas, leave a like on today's video. Stop the panda brutality. We need another TNT. I didn't even look to see what that TNT was called. Oh, my God. <laughs> I think that was a meteor. It uncovered my dragon cave. I guess we might as well go down here for the next one. This one looks like the color selector in Photoshop. Yeah, it's uh, it's called smoke TNT. And I, I don't know, like, is that all it does? Does it explode at all? It's farting all over my, my Minecraft world. This might be my least favorite TNT. The next TNT kind of scares me. It is called attacking TNT. And there's just a sword on it. So I have a weird feeling that it's going to spawn in swords that kill me. Okay, hold on. Let's go try it next to some Minecraft mobs. What's up, Mr. Zambo? See, look, you're a zombie. I'm a zombie. We can trust each other, right? Why are you running? You're supposed to come back here and get exposed. Whoa, whoa, did you guys see that? Dude, it literally got legs or like wheels and then started to run. Guys, I'm doing this for you guys. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that's what it does. It chases you down and then explodes you. <laughs> That thing is effective. Next up on our list of TNTs is Shatterproof TNT. What? Oh my gosh. It turned everything in the area into obsidian. Oh, you could use this to make a really secure base if you wanted to. This will be a good test as well to see which TNTs are powerful enough to get rid of obsidian. This next one is called Cubic TNT. Just like the Sphere TNT, I'm guessing that it just blows up an entire area in a cube. But since we spawned it next to obsidian, it's not powerful enough. What about over here? It did a little bit of damage, not that much. How about our good old friend dividing TNT? What are we going to divide? Whoa, how many TNT did that just split into? Whoa, whoa, how many times did that just multiply? I, I, I honestly have no clue, but dude, it blew up the entire area around here. Okay, this next one's going to be pretty interesting to see. It's called tunneling TNT. Put it next to my favorite stallion. All right, donkey, get ready. Oh, oh wait, oh, it's tunneling TNT. For some reason, I thought it was going to dig into the ground, but this is great for getting through mountains. But check that out, guys. You could easily make a railroad track if you wanted to, or you could blow up that TNT and then place down your next TNT inside called multiplying TNT. It is spawning in way more TNT than it should. Yo, make it stop. There wasn't even any explosion particles. It just erased all the blocks around this area. I have a really nice campsite over here, so I thought it'd be a good idea if we now had a floating campsite by using the floating island TNT. 
Please tell me that worked. Oh my gosh, it actually did. We now have a floating campsite. And now we don't have to worry about the one below it, so we could just blow it up using lightning TNT. Oh, wait, I kind of forgot. Lightning comes from the sky. Luckily, the island was not affected by it. What about another TNT called vaporized TNT? Oh, there's some particle effects going with this. Should I be worried? I guess I'm not that worried. Nobody got vaporized in the making of today's video. Hey, zombie. How would you feel if I summoned in an erupting TNT? Oh, that thing looks hot and steamy. Whoa. Oh my gosh. I swear these TNTs keep getting crazier and crazier. This next one is called zombie apocalypse TNT. Oh my gosh. It made it nighttime too. The zombies are running rampant in this world. What will I ever do? It's not like I have a bunch more TNTs that I can spawn in. This next one is called Cluster Bob. Whoa! How are they still alive? If you could survive a cluster ball, you could survive a meteor shower. Is it working? Oh yeah, it's definitely working. I stand corrected. All of the zombies are dying. That entire area seems pretty decimated, so we're gonna go ahead over to this little tiny mansion. We're gonna go ahead and spawn in the next TNT, the timer TNT. How much time will this take to explode? Today. Hello. We're on a tight schedule here. I got about 70 more levels of TNTs to go through. Keep in mind, guys, we have not even touched the level 50 to 100. TNTs. I have a weird feeling that this one's going to go forever. Oh, never mind. Never mind. It, it did. It just took a little bit of extra time. Sometimes you need patience. It's a good life lesson, ladies and gentlemen. Sometimes you need patience for good things to happen, even though a good thing did not happen. The floating TNT floated up into the sky and still somehow destroyed the entire area below it. And actually kind of made a pretty cool design. I'm not sure why, but I have a weird feeling that this next TNT, the arrow TNT, is going to be really good for killing chickens. All you chicken farmers out there, make sure you do not watch away. Yeah, that worked. And for the chickens that survived, we have the brand new Easter egg TNT. It looks like a carrot. Yeah, the top of it looks like the grass and the bottom part looks like a carrot. Oh my gosh. It didn't even spawn in carrots. Wait, it's spawning in lots more TNT. It's jumping around like the Easter bunny on Christmas. That literally made no sense. What? Why is, why is my brain so weird? Anyway, that is what the Easter TNT does. I don't know why it spawns in pumpkins and melons. I have no idea. I'm super excited for this next one. It's called Phantom TNT. It just disappeared. Weird. Am I able to find it? Do I, is this like a scavenger hunt? I don't think it is. I, I don't even know what it's exploding. I, I think it's just like a phantom TNT. Like it's not a real TNT. I was not good at physics in high school, but I have a weird feeling that this physics TNT is still going to be pretty darn cool. That didn't correlate at all. I don't know why I brought it up, but dude, what? That was sick. It, wait, it actually gave physics to every single block in the area. TNT times 500. This one's going to be probably the most destructive one yet. Oh my gosh. This just caused a massive crater. We also have a TNT called turret TNT. I wonder if this is just going to shoot everything in the area. Let's wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. <laughs> <laughs> Why did that take so long? It didn't even explode anything. Okay, that one was a dud, but how about this next one called Pulse TNT? Wait, this one has some really cool uh, particle effects around it. What's happening? Oh, every explosion is getting bigger. Wait, when does it stop? Please tell me it stops eventually. Is this... Okay, okay, good. I had a weird feeling that that was going to continue to go on until my entire world got deleted. Luckily, that wasn't the case. I have no idea what this next TNT is going to be. It's called Spamming TNT. Oh, well, no, that, that, make, that makes sense. It just filled my entire world with dirt. I don't want any dirt. Not today. I'll call up my brother Dirt Boy and invite him over. I've never heard of a TNT that's called Bouncing TNT. What? What the what? It just keeps going. Wait, it, it's not stopping. When do we know if it explodes? Oh, it... Oh, it found the sheep. It did not like the sheep. It exploded the sheep. It's probably for the best because our level 50 TNT is one of the more powerful ones. Nuclear TNT. I am nervous. I am still nervous. I am super duper nervous. Oh my gosh. Wait, wait a second, dude. The birch trees got deleted. They all got haircuts. The explosion itself honestly wasn't that big. It was probably as big as the times 500 TNT, but you also get wither, poison, and nausea from each even touching any of the radiation blocks. And it looks like trees for miles all got bald. For literally miles. I was not kidding. This one's called Angry Miners. They have dynamite. What would happen if I just spawned in a zombie? Zombie seems to be fine. What about a villager? What about if I were to go into survival mode? Do they like me? Oh God. Oh, 
That was rude. Level 52 is called Meteor Storm. These next couple of TNTs are going to be some of the most insane TNTs that you've ever seen in your entire life. Oh my God, it broke through all the way down there. Dude, it just keeps going. My world is getting deleted before my eyes. I don't know about you guys, but I've never seen so much destruction in one singular Minecraft world. You guys remember that nuclear bomb that we just exploded? Well, this is the upgraded version of that called the SAR bomb. It disappeared as soon as it, as soon as I lit it. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Gosh, oh my gosh. Are we safe? Oh, we are not safe, dude. Look at it. Obsidian was able to handle the impact, but all of the blocks surrounding us was not. This gives us a good platform for the next TNT, which is called End Gate. This one might actually build something, so I'm a little bit more excited because we've had enough destruction for today. Did it? Oh, oh, <laughs> it just dropped Enderman from the sky. This next one is literally called Chunk TNT. By the name and by all the particles, I have a weird feeling that the entire chunk is about to be deleted. Oh, snap. Okay, it did not go all the way down to bedrock, ladies and gentlemen, but it did delete a massive chunk of land. Look at this. We have a pretty good platform for our next TNT. This TNT is called compressed TNT. Is it a bunch of TNTs compressed together into one singular TNT? Let's find out, I guess. Oh, well, that was dumb. Wait, 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 what's this? It spawned in another TNT. This one's called dense TNT. Wait, wait, oh, no way. Oh my explosion! Dude, look at this! It doesn't stop. It's spawning a normal TNT. I don't think I've ever seen this much TNT blow up. Okay, we're gonna place one bastion TNT on top of the diamonds to see what happens. Oh, what? It spawned in a bastion? That's crazy. Wait, guys, now we can blow it up. I have no idea how to pronounce this next TNT. Fredifort. All right, well, whatever it is, we are about to explode it. I have a weird feeling it's gonna fall from the sky. Oh my goodness. It didn't break anything. The bastion was too strong. Okay, wait, we're gonna have to try it again over here. Wait, wait, oh. I take everything that I just said back. I lied. That was probably one of the meteors that took out the dinosaurs and started the Jurassic period. I have no words for this. I, I'm, I'm just going around the edge right now and every single block is disappearing before my two very, very excitedly amused eyes. Okay, guys, we are going to have to go on a quick marathon of TNTs here. This next one is called... Uh, the, the leaping TNT. Very similar to the bouncy TNT, except the leaping TNT explodes every single time it lands. Use that one to troll your friends. This TNT is legitimately just made out of bedrock. It's called unbreakable TNT. Well, yep. Everything is now unbreakable here. We're using a TNT called Poseidon's Wave. Oh gosh, it's raining. Where's the wave? There's, there's gotta be a wave, right? That's what it's called. Oh my gosh. It's not as much water as I thought, but dude, look at that. It spawned in like a mini lake. And on top of the lake, we can use this next TNT to summon in a mansion. Wait a second. It's not like a woodland mansion. It's literally just like a mansion. It's just like a normal mansion. And what we can do now that we have an actual mansion, another structure to destroy, is spawn in something called Stone Cold. Wait, what? What is going on? Okay, so the stone cold TNT turned everything in the area into ice. Literally all of this into ice. And it even extended over there and turned those blocks into snow blocks. These TNTs are getting stronger and stronger. Okay, we have to test out another TNT, which we probably know what it's going to do. It's called jumping TNT. It's gonna jump around and I guess it multiplies too and spawns in like a leaping TNT everywhere that it goes. So this one would cause a lot of destruction like all over your Minecraft world. So be careful with that one. How about just like, you know, a quick, solar eruption TNT. Yeah, all right. So that's just, it's just shooting meteors up into the sky. It's not, it's not like a normal volcano. It is literally a volcano made from the sun that spawns in lava. Yeah, that's it. This is, this is a lot of destruction. I don't think I've ever destroyed one Minecraft world this much in my entire existence. Un llama, one knockback TNT, and let's just see what happens to this llama. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was hoping would happen. We made a llama cannon. <laughs> okay, in our lava and ice uh, place, that's, yep, that's what we're gonna call this place. We are going to explode this TNT called a hexahedron. I want you guys to comment down below what a hexahedron is so that my puny brain can understand. Did it, uh, did, did it, did, did it, do? I don't know exactly what that did, but it exploded part of the house. We have another fancy TNT over here called extinction. Now, what? Look, I mean, extinction, right? It's just... 
was in creative mode. We exploded one TNT called Poseidon's Wave. This one is where Poseidon lives, I'm pretty sure, Atlantis. Okay, it still has not fully exploded yet. It like spawned in lightning as soon as we lit it on fire and caused a lot of rain to happen. Wait, oh my gosh. Okay, so it is a bigger version of Poseidon's Wave. That's really all, all it is. And it, yeah, it got rid of every single lava pool in the area. This next one is called Russian Roulette. What could this one possibly be? Is it just like a random TNT that could spawn in? I think so. Yeah, I think it has a chance of exploding and maybe a chance of not exploding. There's a TNT called the Wither Storm. I honestly did not know that up until this very second, and I am terrified. Yeah, right above its head, there's particle effects that looks like the Wither. Is it actually going to summon in the Wither Storm? Because if it does, I'm going to cry. Oh, it spawned in something. Oh, it spawned in a wither boss. Okay, it's just, it's one singular wither boss, luckily. And it also spawned in like a bunch of wither skeletons and soul sand in the area. It's not that bad, honestly. We might be able to get rid of it by spawning in a lucky TNT. So the lucky TNT looks like it has a chance of turning into any single TNT in the mod. That was just the fiery TNT, which was like the level two TNT. But we also have the ultimate volcano TNT, Pompeii. They named a TNT after the volcano in Pompeii. Oh my gosh. The volcano TNT. TNTs are arguably some of the most destructive TNTs in the entire Lucky TNT mod. I kind of ran out of all the other areas to wreck. This next one, by the way, is called Heaven's Gate. So maybe it'll just clear everything up. Maybe it'll actually like do some good. Wait, did it? I have no idea if that did anything good. It's Oh, nope. It just brought all of the blocks from below all the way up here and created even more of a masterpiece. I don't even know what I made, but this is modern art. Well, guys, we cannot stop now. We still have lots more TNTs to get through. This one is called Light. Lightning Storm. Can confirm that is a lightning storm. The next level TNT is called the Midas TNT. Oh my gosh. Look at all the gold. Wait a second. I got, I got turned. I wait, Midas touch. What does Midas touch do? I think everything that I touch now turns to gold. That actually looks so cool. This next one is called Helix TNT. Oh wait, that is so cool. It is just sending out tons of TNT. And then those TNTs are sending out more TNT. And then those TNTs are raining down even more TNT. There's just so much TNT and it just keeps raining TNT. Can somebody please count how many times in today's video I said the words TNT? Oh, okay. I like this one. Next one. It's uh, it's called Jungle TNT. We could use a nice jungle in my massive TNT art. I probably should have put it in the center thinking back on it, but there, there's really, there's no turning around now. It actually turned out okay. It only replaced a couple of the blocks. And now we're going to do the complete opposite. There is a TNT called the Wasteland TNT. And of course, because I, legally speaking, have to do this, we are going to explode the Wasteland. Land TNT. Oh, my game is lagging. Oh, no! What just happened, dude? It got rid of all of the water. Okay, this up here actually looks pretty sick. I, I kind of, I just want to like see what it looks like at the end. We're going to keep exploding things. This next one's called City Firework. Oh, that was not explosive. We now have floating houses all over this entire world. And speaking of more fireworks, this next TNT is called New Year's Eve Fireworks. That one went up quick. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> it spawned in blocks everywhere. And we could spot in this chick's club. Oh no, guys, I have a weird feeling about this one. Oh no. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> Dust Bowl TNT, activate, do your worst. What does Dust Bowl TNT even do? Does anybody know what that did? I have no clue. We have another fun TNT. It's just called Random TNT. So just like the Lucky TNT, I think anything could happen here. Please rain cookies. There are no cookies. Some of the TNT's names are so weird. This one's called Mankind's Mark. What? It just spawned in like houses. And right above it, we could try out this TNT called Toxic Cloud TNT. Okay, we're gonna look up to the skies to see if there's any toxic clouds that start forming. So far so good i think we're safe this next one is called hyperion what is hyperion oh i think it's a tree yeah wait that definitely looks like a tree we're about to have a massive tree in the center of our minecraft sculpture hey what i think these are the toxic clouds the next one is called village defense like we've exploded every single structure in my minecraft world and now like this is the only place that i have left okay village defense spawn did i don't even know how many iron golems that is okay okay what we're gonna do is we're gonna also summon in a pillager outpost right here and then they are going to go to war. Good luck, Iron Golems. Oh, it spawned it all the way down there. All right, fine, fine, fine. That's that's okay. That's okay. We're gonna we're gonna blow up the Iron Golems instead using Compact TNT. Compact TNT did not do the trick. Now they're all suffering. Okay, okay, guys, chill, chill, chill. We're gonna use another TNT called Pulsar TNT. The particle effects on that look deadly. 
Um, do we understand what's happening right now? What the flip just happened? It opened up an entire crater. This looks amazing. The water is so glitched out right now. I've never seen water like this. Okay, this next TNT is called Mountain Top Removal. I ideally, probably, yes, I know what you guys are saying. You should use it on a mountain, but do not worry. It'll work here. Did it work? Heck yeah, it did. Look at that. Look at that. It just leveled all this area. I also walked into one of the clouds, so now I'm sick. This is the level 95 TNT. It is a legit supernova. Where is it going to come from? The sky? The void? Is it just going to blow up right here? My computer, I think, is broken. Oh, snap. Do you guys see this? What the heck? Also, I don't know what happened over here, but something over here opened up the void. Guys, that was only level 95. This next one, I'm just gonna do it in the center of this crater over here. It's literally just called Doomsday. Okay, we're just setting the mood right now. It's summoning in lightning. It's summoning in hail. What do we got? Meteors falling from the sky. It's raining. I don't know if it's gonna cause any actual explosions. So we're gonna move over to the next one. This one is called Death Ray. Oh, that sounds deadly. I've used this one one other time. And let let me tell you guys it's bad it's really bad it's 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 bad guys that's all i can say it is terrible look at it it's like fano snapped his fingers and exploded everything in existence oh my gosh that is the most satisfying thing ever dude look at it it's just vaporizing blocks and then it turns the edge of the blocks into lava one of the tnts is called global disaster i'm gonna try out the tnt type 10,000 first just to see what happens okay we're gonna go up here to like a slightly fresher area and then we're gonna place it down right here tnt times 10,000. it's so ironic that it's pink too like you would think this would be like a nice cute and cuddly tnt but no it is tnt times 10,000. oh it exploded okay some of the mobs died immediately but i'm not seeing any blocks even like the the doomsday stopped do i even move oh my gosh wait i can move my computer is tweaking right now i can hear it it sounds like literally a jet engine is inside my computer what is happening is it deleting blocks like it's trying to delete blocks but it's not able to i have no clue i am so confused right now okay there's like explosions in the sky there's like a little explosion over here oh guys yeah, something happened oh my gosh oh 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 there's one final tnt that we have to test out global disaster i don't know if my computer can handle this oh wait okay meteors are exploding things we're going for it three two one i'm pretty sure my computer crashed family member that I want to show you. Oh, I named him after your dad, actually. Oh, because he's a dog. Poop man. No, his name's oh. Poop Man. Because my dad's a dog. <laughs> no, it's because your dad eats poop. Who told you that? Let's go over here. And we're going to use the level one TNT to blow up the top of their house. <laughs> Whoa! What was that? No, 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 no! Dude, our what, villagers what are up there. Wait, I'm gonna go check on it. <laughs> they look so confused. Why is there a big no! hole? In Did they all die? What the heck? I think one of the villagers got a little mad and blew up, blew everything up. Why can't I go up the freaking ladder? This next TNT is called TNT times five. As you guys can probably tell, it is five times more powerful than normal TNT. <laughs> All of their cows turned to beef. Ow! Ah! Wait, it, these are like wither explosions. Did you spawn a wither already? What's happening? They have to be very confused right about now. Dude, wait, there's actually so much meat here. Wait, our cow farm, bro. Yeah, I know, bro. What They're are you doing? I'm picking up all the meat, all the excess meat. You know how long that took me to make? Next up, guys, we have the level three TNT. This is called the structure TNT, and I could use it to spawn in any structure in Minecraft. But guys, I have a particular one in mind. Why are you blowing stuff up? Is it, it because it I called you fat? Is it, it because wasn't I- me! It wasn't I me! I was kidding! Wait for it. Oh, guys, check it out! We now have a pillager outpost. You're not that fat. No! See? Dude, that no, wasn't no, me. no, 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 no. You're triggering it from a pressure you plate. Know that, yeah, I'm triggering it from, Dude, you're just saying words right now. I'm gonna go ahead and give both of my friends a bad omen. That way, a raid will immediately start. What else just blew up? It better not be the pig farm. It better not be my flipping pigs. This is pretty much your family oh. tree. What is happening, though? Why is anything blowing up? You see these villagers right here? They They're about make to make love. a little baby villager. Yeah. Some sweet love. Oh, they just made a baby. <laughs> that was so romantic. They just touch noses and then a little baby pops out. You want to try? Yeah. Okay, come here. Are they kissing? What are they doing? Do we kiss? What are, uh... <laughs> 
We're gonna hit both of them. Ow! Wait, that wasn't even me. <laughs> so we just did all that for no baby? Are you kidding me? Yeah, that was ridiculous. Um, I barely enjoyed that. I maybe did more than you, but anyway, um, I'm gonna go back to the house and fi try to figure out what the heck's going on with all these explosions. What the heck is this? They captured a ravager and named it Tiny. What kind of sick joke is this? It might be the Wither Storm. I think I spawned it in. I'm not exactly sure what how to spawn it in, but hang on, rewind and say that again, please. I might have spawned in the Wither Storm. Okay. How do you accidentally maybe forget or even not know if you spawned it in or not? I had a lot of dirt today, if I'm being honest. So I really don't know what I'm doing on a day-to-day -day basis. <laughs> I haven't heard an explosion in a little bit. So how about we just go kill the Wither Boss ourselves and we get the Nether Star, get a beacon yeah. going. Yep. Yep. All right, let's do it. The level four TNT is called Fire TNT. What we can do is add this to the top of the Pillager Outpost. That way, they're going to be even more confused. Oh my gosh, the entire thing just got set on fire. Yeah, wait, 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 you're just going to spawn in right here? Well, yeah, underground. That's okay, all right, it. all right, all right. Ah, let's go. Wait, did they just spawn in the Wither Boss? What? Oh my Watch God, out for my man. dad. Watch out for my dad. Oh no, poor He's going to die. No, he's going to be okay. Bro, what is happening? Where did they spawn this in? Dad, get out of there. Where'd he go? Oh, oh my God. Ah! Oh my gosh. They're literally fighting the Wither Boss. Wait, guys, this is great. We could add in another TNT. I can't even reach him. Jump and hit him, you dingus. Oh my gosh. Why would you spawn him in right here? No! Not Poop Man. Poop Man. This one's called Gravity TNT. They're getting sucked into the wall. <laughs> my dad died. Oh, I'm getting sucked. Get off me. Oh my gosh. That's awesome. <laughs> what the heck was that? Adam, help me kill this thing. Dude, I can't reach. Yes, you can. We're going to add in another one over here. Let's see if they can see this one. Ah, I'm getting poking. sucked again. <laughs> Is this the Wither Store's new special move? I've literally never seen that before. I don't know what's going on, but oh it's my like god! inside ah! you. <laughs> we can also add in another TNT called Animal TNT. I have a pretty good feeling that this will spawn in tons of animals. Oh, I got a hit. I got a hit. I got a hit. All right, stay in there and get more hits. Oh, wait. I can do the Elytra. I'm going to fly up. Oh, my gosh. Oh, holy heck. What is that? Ah, bad idea! Bad idea! What I'm gonna have to run. Says? I just killed a llama. No regrets. It spawned in the entire zoo. Even Piglin spawned in. I'm about to die. I'm about to die. Die with her. Kill it, Alec. I'm trying. Guys, I have a great idea for the next TNT. We go all the way up to the surface and spawn in the drilling TNT. It should mine all the way down to bedrock. We just opened up a portal for the wither to go up. I'm gonna die! Oh, I'm getting shots! I'm getting shots! Get it out! Get it! Ah! It's going after me! I'm gonna die! We need to pull over here. We'll use the gravity TNT. Come on! I have half a heart. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Ah! I look if I die. I just gotta tell you one thing, man. What is it, bro? I'm the one that ate your cookies out of the chest. It was me. And I loved every second of it. I loved every second of it! Ah! Ah! We're all getting sucked up! <laughs> and then he got launched. He just keeps getting sent to outer space. I'm alive. Are you alive? I died. <laughs> I died. Did we kill the weather storm? Yeah, no, thing? I killed it. But I oh, didn't nice. celebrate because High five. You, you ate my cookies, bro. Oh. That was, no, that was my previous life. I'm a new man now. I respawned. Somehow the boys were able to beat the Wither Boss. Let's go ahead and have them celebrate with TNT fireworks. This is the level 10 TNT. There it goes. Oh! Take it off and turn around. So much worse than I thought it would be. Adam? You see what happens when you touch me. Everything blew up. That's right. I did that. That was me. Look at their house. And guys, we haven't even gotten into the level 75 to 100 TNTs. Why would you blow up our house? To show you my power. I'm a freaking god. Okay, but for real, I did not actually blow up the house. So what happened? For our next TNT, level 11, we are going to spawn in one of my personal favorites, erupting TNT. Wait for it. Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> All I know is you killed me, then everything blew up. When oh my god! What is happening? Look at his neck. <laughs> Dude, stop! Do you know how long it took us to build this house? Why are you telling me to stop like I'm doing it? We built our first farm here. We went to the nether here. We made a family here. Poop man's dead. I'm gonna cry. You know how long it took me, my little brain, to figure out how to collect the blocks and place them? 
<laughs> oh my gosh, this is literally gonna take three real life weeks to rebuild. I bet you the boys are kind of sick of it being nighttime. So we're gonna use the day TNT. It's daytime. What are you doing? Just say you hate me. Stop, Adam, it's not me. But we can also spawn in this, which is the nighttime TNT. Nighttime. Why, dude, the day cycles are going by so quick. Oh it's already gosh. nighttime again. What, it's daytime. Daytime, nighttime. Wait, did he see me? Wait, look, look up, look at the tree, look at the tree. What is what, that? What? Black That's TNT. TNT. But it was black TNT. Oh, wait, it's changing it to nighttime. I think he saw something. Luckily, I do have the Vanish mod installed. So even though you guys can see me, they have no clue what's happening. I've never yeah. seen that TNT before. Why is, is it going it, off on top of a tree? Wait, someone, is someone, I'm going to tell you what I think it is. And then you tell me what you think it is. I'm going to spawn a TNT right in between them and see what they do. Okay, how about we just say it on three? Okay. One, two, three. Jack! Jack! Yes! It's Jack! I yes! know it, bro! Yes! He's always in our flipping world! <laughs> three, two, one. It's so annoying! I thought it was you for the longest time! It has to be him. <laughs> he doesn't even know what it is. We spawned in the level 20 TNT. The meteor TNT. That's not good. That's not, That means he's invisible. Oh my god! Holy cow, bro! That's a whole lot of TNT. But guys, this is not Nothing compared to the god TNTs that we're trying out at the end of today's video. We got blown up by a flipping meteor. I knew it. I saw the T. It was TNT. I saw it and then it exploded right in my face. We know it's Jack, but I can't even do anything about it. What are we supposed to do? Oh, yes. Wait, our chest room is still good. Yes, my dirt, my dirt, my dirt. Come here, babies. Come here, babies. How about we just run as far away as possible? Maybe that's what we should do. All right. Yeah, I can't die again. Let's get out of here. It looks like the boys are abandoning their village. Don't worry. I will bring all of the TNTs. You know what? Where's one place TNT? TNT can never explode. Water! Genius, Adam! I know! There's a ship in here! Look, it's a little ship. Oh, let's go, let's go! Where you going, boys? We're gonna drop in a TNT called Attacking TNT. Oh, wait, there's TNT! Ah! Adam's swimming away. It can't blow up in the water. We're fine. We're fine. Yeah, it doesn't blow up. Wait, Adam, come here. Come here. Come here. Wait, it floated all the way to the top. The TNT tries to track any nearby player down and it explode right next to them. <laughs> Wait, it actually worked. It didn't do anything. We right, outsmarted no, we, him. We did it, bro. We did it. We're going to throw that down right there. I don't know if it's super effective in the water. Oh, there's not a piece of TNT. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't do anything. <laughs> oh, my gosh. He almost swam right into it. Also, I think they're drowning. Uh, I'm dying. Wait, but, yeah, I'm kind of drowning. I can't have the boys drown. That wouldn't be fun. We have to build a house under here somehow. How are we supposed to do that, though? I, I got understand. stacks on stacks of dirt. Don't you worry, kid. I'm gonna die. Dude, swim. I can't swim. This game sucks, <laughs> man. <laughs> Since the boys are in a vast ocean, I think we can make it a little bit more cozy with a lava ocean TNT. Here you go, Adam. Oh my gosh, he didn't even notice it. Um, he's blowing up your house. Ah! Ah! <laughs> he is surrounded by lava. Everything here just turned into obsidian. And look, Alex just swimming around. I thought I outsmarted him. Where are you? I'm at the bottom of the sea. It's not letting me swim. I'm like running on the bottom of the ocean. Okay, I'm just dead. Like, what, what am I supposed to do? Oh, <laughs> Why does he look like an injured dolphin? What was that? I literally cannot swim, so if I go in there again, I'm gonna die. I'm trying to build a little safe haven for you. This is the only way we can survive. Are they really trying to build a base out in the middle of the ocean? Does he not see that he's getting attacked? Don't worry, there, boy. I'll help you out. How can you not swim, bro? You've never I don't like know. you never went to swim class as a kid. I guess not, dude. I don't know. I'm really good at running at the bottom of the ocean now. We'll add in a physics TNT, the level 25 TNT. Oh my gosh, I see another piece of TNT. Oh yeah, I see. What is that? I kind of forget what this one does. Oh. Oh my gosh. How is he killing me underwater? I didn't realize that would happen. Okay. So maybe our plan did not work. I don't know what to do now. Okay. Alex hanging out right over there. We're going to add in this TNT called bouncing TNT. Oh. <laughs> It just goes in random directions. I see another TNT. It's it's in the air. What if I shoot it with a bow and arrow? What happens? Is it going to explode or is it just going to hop around? What's happening? While he's occupied with that, we could add in this TNT. The upgraded version called the jumping TNT. Sorry, ah! we need to fly away a little bit. Yeah, let's go. Okay, yeah, let's get out of here. Look at it, dude. Every time it lands, it's spawning in a bouncing TNT. I'm in the flipping water. Why I got stuck in the ocean. ocean. It's raining TNT. Adam, hurry up. Get back All right, I'm here. I'm flying away. All right, go, Adam, go. Yeah, that's right, boys. You should probably fly away and never come back. But don't worry, guys. We're not done yet. Oh, yeah, we're definitely safe on this island. Okay, yeah, yeah, let's go on the, yeah, 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 let's go on the island. Okay, here we go. Dig straight down. I did find this TNT called Troll TNT. This is the level 30 TNT. 
Oh my god, it's still trying to explode me. Get down here now. <laughs> it immediately exploded and he dipped. Ah, oh my god, I'm on one heart. Okay, there we go. We got access to water now. Okay, wait, yeah, this is genius, Adam. You're actually so smart for this. How is he supposed to kill us now? Another TNT we can try out is the level 35 TNT, which just swaps players. See what happens if I place it down, hit that TNT. Oh, dude, the players and the mobs are all getting swapped. I'm getting swapped. Uh, oh my gosh. I'm getting I just got TP'd. I got TP'd. I got TP'd. Where am I? Oh my gosh. Wait, we separated. Adam is getting chased by two spiders. They actually make that zero spiders and a witch. The boys are not having a good day. We say crouch. He probably doesn't know where we are. Wait, that's true. But I'm, I'm on the middle of a random island. I'm underground. I'm in like a little secret bunker. I'm getting freaking torn up right now. Wait, I survived. I'm kingpin. They all have to respect me now. I'm going to see what Adam does if I just spawn in a nuke. Ah, oh, I broke it. I broke it. I stole it. <laughs> Another nuke. Another nuke. Yes, yes. Get it. Steal it. I have four nuclear TNT. Another nuke. Another nuke. I see him flying. He's a bat. What if I spawn in this? Oh my God, there's, more, there's more. I'm getting more. He's morphing into a bat. He's morphing into a bat. I'm going to kill him. Come here, you stupid. Wait, he broke it. Uh-oh. He didn't break that one. <laughs> Guys, we have activated the level 50 TNT, the nuclear TNT. Ah, I hear TNT. Yeah! Him. I got him. I got him. Let's go. Run, run, Wait, run, I got him. I killed him. Run, run, oh, God. Oh, God. Run. I killed him. No. <laughs> Their boy is no longer with us. The level 100 TNT is going to be literally 100 times bigger than this. Alec, I would not come back. There's a lot of nuclear poop. Oh my gosh, I forgot about our iron golem. This dude will tank any TNT hit. Well, I do have four nuclear TNT. What are you, you're um, gonna blow us up? Wait, unbreakable TNT. Maybe that'll make us a bunker. Wait a second. The boys are, wait, they're lighting their own TNT? All right, please make us a bunker. Please make us a, oh, whoa. Interesting. That actually kind of helped them. Now they can make a base out of bedrock. We can't get inside. Oh, here we go. We got a little crevice here. Yes, I'm inside. Okay, while they're preoccupied with that, we are going to move along to the level 51 TNT called Village Defense. Let's see what this one does. Oh my goodness. That spawned in so many. Dude, oh. things are exploding. Is this you? No, no, that's not me. But we're okay. safe. Look, he's trying to yeah, kill wait. us and he can't. He can't destroy bedrock. We're just gonna light off a couple of these. Just a few. Oh my goodness, bro. That is a whole lot of iron power. Okay, I can't find the entrance, but I'm just, I'm building a house where he'll literally oh. never be able to Adam, kill I hear, I hear a TNT explosion. I'm surrounded by bedrock. I'm actually yeah. fine. He literally can't touch us here. Let's go. What a loser. While the boys are down there, we're going to light the level 55 TNT, which is called Hyperion. I think it spawns in a giant tree. Oh, never mind. It just spawns in a couple trees. I feel like we need more trees. Kind of want some trees right there. Maybe a couple trees over here. Ah, yes. We can also go over here and add in the end gate. <laughs> I didn't realize that's what it did. That was kind of lame. Adam, come here. I have a game plan. Get on this block and jump. Okay, I'm jumping. Okay, now what we're gonna do? Genius. Genius. Wait, why are we so close together? Wait for it. They're literally stuck in the hole, hugging each other for life. <laughs> Somehow we have to figure out how to get them out of there. And I have just the idea. Okay, now crawl. Crawl, Adam, crawl. Wait, what the heck? Yeah. What's going on? How did you do We're that? We're in. There's no way you can kill us now. It's impossible. So if I spawn in the level 60 TNT, reverse TNT, it should flip this entire thing upside down. Oh my gosh, my game's lagging. Oh my goodness. Oh, my game just froze for a sec, yeah, but me he too. still didn't kill us. I'm plugging up every hole. That was probably like his best TNT too, and he still couldn't kill us. This looks like something out of the Doctor Strange movie. I still have to figure out how to get the boys out of there. What if we try to use a bunch of ocean water? We'll use the level 62 TNT ocean TNT. Come on. Oh my goodness. Bro, that's a whole lot of calamari. Oh, I hear TNT. Be careful. Brace yourself. Bro, we're good. This kid's a loser. What a freaking nerd. Oh no. I'm drowning. Are you underwater? Build oh my gosh. Build, 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 Wait, how do we get out of here? Oh, they're drowning. They're drowning. I'm dying. Break it. Oh, I'm trying. Dude. Get out of my way. Adam. You gotta break it. I am trying. I'm, I'm oh, yes, yes, yes. Come on. No. no. I feel so bad. They've been exploded so many times and now they're drowning. He drowned us out, bro. Are you kidding me? I thought we outsmarted him. There's like an island in the sky. What is he trying? Oh my gosh. What TNT is that? Dude, this is all they see. <laughs> That's honestly so cool. What is this? Are oh, we gonna get to the top of this thing? It's our village, but it's like upside down. He inverted our village. This is what I'm gonna do when I see Beck, bro. Ah! Ah! They are on top of the reversed planet. That was a great time to add in the knockback TNT. Ah! What, 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 what? Run! They're flying away. Adam can't fly. <laughs> 
Okay, if they would have stayed there for a little bit, that would have knocked them entirely off of this planet. What's the only thing stronger than bedrock? Friendship. Close. The answer is dirt. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna build an epic dirt house that is indestructible. They're attempting to build a house. I'm going to go under this, and we're gonna add in a hexahedron TNT. This is the level 72 TNT. Dude, he's, he might quit the game. He's probably shaking right now. He's like, oh god, I didn't know they'd come up with the dirt house. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that took out almost an entire chunk. Not good enough, though. This next TNT looks pretty scary. It's called Mimic TNT. We're gonna spawn it right down there, and let's see what happens. No, 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 no. Another one, another one, another one, another one. Get another in the one, house! Another one, another Get one, in the another house! One, another one, another We're one, safe another here! We're one, safe! Another one. We gotta build the roof, quick. Oh, wait. It just looks like a normal block. Oh, my gosh. You can't even tell there's TNT. Quicker, quicker, quicker! I, I, I'm out of dirt. Oh, my gosh. How are you ever out of dirt? Because you eat it all. Wait a second. So, if I were to go here, and then I quickly light it while they're busy, light it. Oh, my Oh my gosh, no, dude! Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> that might have been our quickest death. I just accidentally exploded them. Whatever TNT blew up, just vaporized the dirt. We just got smoked. We got deleted. I think the boys have maybe suffered enough. We're moving along to the level 75 to 100 TNTs. The last one is literally called the grand finale. I'm gonna set off some nuclear TNT just because I want to see what happens. Maybe I'll kill him Oh, maybe, in the yeah. Maybe you'll blow him up. He has to be invisible right now. Ready? Oh Three, two, do it. one. Do it. Do it for the pigs. Oh my god. Hey, there's another TNT right there. Oh, did you blow yourself up? Do not fly back. You will die. We're going to spawn in a mansion TNT. This will give the boys some place to hide. That's a nice looking mansion. All right. Yeah, I'm not going back up there. I'm sorry. Wait, there's I'm a house not. though. There's a whole house up here now. Oh, wait, there is. I'm coming. We'll spawn on another one right there. Yo, oh, there's another house. Oh, wait, there's one for both of us. <laughs> and then another one right up here. Oh, there's another one. Yo, this is freaking cool. And there's coal in the chest. Yo, full netherite armor. I'm just going to keep making them go higher and higher. Boom. Another one. It's actually kind of beautiful. <sighs> I'm kind of stacked right now. Oh, and you're dead. Did Alec really just jump off of the house and die? Bro, what a dork. Wait, you said that there's full nether right there? Where? Yes, in the chest. The level 80 TNT is a TNT. That is one of my favorite. It is called Stone Cold. This is going to turn everything into the Ice Age. Check that out, boys. Wait, what just happened? <laughs> everything just turned to ice. Now, the only thing I can think that's worse than the Ice Age is an actual meteor storm. We're going to spawn that one right there. Good luck fellas. Oh my god, there's TNT falling from the sky. What is happening? This has got to be a dream. Oh my gosh, this is so sick. Dude, look at the meteors falling everywhere. It took out the top house. Oh my god. The entire island is blown up. I don't even know where the village is anymore. I'm surprised they haven't gone to the nether. Honestly, that's what I would do if my entire world was getting exploded. But huh, more fun for me. We're going to add in one of my also personal favorites, the jungle TNT. This thing is insane. Hashtag team trees, boys. Oh my gosh. I feel like I just opened up a portal to Jumanji. You know what I'm starting to believe? I have a little theory. What is it? You got jealous. Here we go. That my dad is okay. Poop Man. So what'd you do? You made a whole little scheme, didn't you? You thought it through. You got the dog. You made fun of my dad, even though you're jealous. And you made me feel like crap. Then what'd you do? Once that dog died, you blew up everything just to shove it in my face. You knew I built this whole village. You know how much time I spent on this village. This was all I had. And you took it away. It's never been Jack. Jack's never been here. The only person I see whenever I turn a corner is you. And whenever I'm with you, I get blown up. Then leave. If you actually think this was me, then leave. That's my only solution. Get away from me. If I see you within a 20 mile radius, you are dead on sight. It wasn't me. And if you really think it was me, then get out. I'm, I'm leaving. You can have that stupid village all to yourself, dummy. I just watched you die, you dinkus. Okay, it looks like Alex just hanging out right there. We're gonna add in this TNT. This one is called the Colossal TNT. Look at it. Oh my god! Does he see it? He definitely sees it. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is so sick! Adam, tell my mom I love her! Wait, I'm alive. Did he survive? He looks like he's still alive. He is not moving. Alec, guys, I think I broke him. I lived. Okay, now that was cool. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> what was that? That is a whole lot of blocks, boys. And now is my perfect opportunity to add in the death ray TNT. What is that? What am I hearing? Good luck, Adam. Why do I feel like he can see me? Do you hear that, Adam? 
up! I see him! It wasn't you! Adam! It wasn't you! I gotta go! Ah! There's no way he's surviving this! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I have to use that on Alec. We're gonna use it right in the center of this jungle. Here it goes. No, 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 not again, not again, not again. No, not again. No, not again. No, no. Here we go. Get ready for the show, boys. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god! Coolest thing ever. What is happening? Jax is showing the game. Jax is showing the game. Oh my god, I knew it. Are you boys ready for the grand finale? Oh my no. god. Here we go. Get ready for what a show, boys. No, no, no. Stop <laughs> dead. Why would you do this? I want to play Minecraft with my friends. This one's actually kind of nice, isn't it? Oh my goodness, this is insane. Did you guys have a favorite? No! <laughs> Every single one stunk. Are you sure you guys didn't like the death ray? Oh my god. What is wrong with you? You're messed up in the brain, Jack. You're messed up. You got something wrong with you, man. This isn't right. This isn't funny. Definitely working. <laughs> That was awesome. That was only level five. You guys will not believe what the level 100 TNT looks like. The level 10 TNT is called box TNT and supposedly it just makes a box. That sounds kind of dumb. It literally just made a box. How many boxes can I make? Box number two, box number three. All right, I'm kind of getting sick and tired of this. The next TNT is called spiral TNT. Wait, is it just floating up into the air? That is so cool. Oh my gosh, it's shooting out TNTs in a spiral. <laughs> that was way more destructive than I thought it'd be. Oh, no. All my TNTs got knocked off the wall. I'm pretty sure we were on the level 15 TNT. This bad boy is called BTNT. Oh, my God. That's a lot of angry bees. Eat flames, Bumblebee. How many bees can I summon in? For those of you guys that do not like Bumblebees and are horribly afraid of them like I am, I am extremely sorry. <laughs> There's so many of them. Let's grab the level 20 TNT and we'll see if this can fix our B problem. Oh, it summons in a bunch of arrows. I have an idea. Die, die, die. <laughs> I also don't really know why this is called cactus TNT. It should be called arrow TNT. It's summoning in so many arrows, but every single one is missing the bumblebees. Hopefully the level 25 TNT called fire TNT will be able to set ablaze every single bumblebee. Have a little bit of fire. Wow, the particle effects are actually super cool. And it's burning the bumblebees. This is great. This is this is a nice two for one. Hey, bumblebee, what are you doing? These are, these are my TNTs. Back up. You don't even have to do your own taxes. The level 30 TNT is one of my personal favorites called the Creeper TNT. Gee, I wonder what this is going to do, guys. It's totally probably going to spawn in charge creepers. Wait a second. I thought they were just going to be normal creepers. Wait, can I just explode these? Oh... Oh, that's awesome. I wonder if I could use the box TNT to trap all of the creepers inside one giant cage. Did it work? Hello? Nope, I'm pretty sure they just died. But what I can do is just spawn in a bunch of different creeper TNTs in the box. Uh, I probably am going to kill a couple of them. <laughs> And this is a great time to test out the next TNT, which is called Gravity TNT. Let's see what this one does. Oh, <laughs> they're all getting sucked right into the center of it. That is awesome. It's literally blowing them away. Oh, I think, I think their knees just broke. What happens if I use the Gravity TNT outside of the box that we created? You got to be able to feed the Gravity TNT. Wait a second. Where are you guys going? Oh my gosh! It's like I'm summoning in a creeper airstrike. Except instead of exploding, they all just fall down and break their kneecaps. The level 35 TNT is called Force TNT. The texture on that one looked really cool. And uh, did it just teleport me? All right, we're just going to stand right next to it. Oh! Yeah, I think it actually teleports me. Or at least it throws me back. This one could be really cool to test after we do this next TNT called Animal TNT. Oh my gosh, it just summoned every mob in Minecraft. Just a few more. All right, there you go. Welcome to the party, everybody. All right, we're gonna go ahead and summon in the Force TNT. Oh, something just exploded it. But I honestly think that the Gravity TNT might be just a little bit better. <laughs> 
<laughs> Dude, it's like a tornado. That is so funny. <laughs> oh, that's so good. The level 40 TNT randomly teleports any player in the area, but it might also teleport mobs. Oh, well, it definitely teleports me. But let's go see if it works on our friend, Mr. Iron Golem. All right, if I get far enough away, it still teleports me. And it did not teleport the Iron Golem, so I think this one probably only works on players. The level 45 TNT is called the Water TNT. It's looking like you could use a little bit of water there. Let's see what this one does. Oh! Oh my gosh, wait, it spawns in water and it also spawns in guardians. We can make an entire ocean using this one. Somebody spawns into gravity TNT. I have no idea who the heck that could have been, but like, I, I, I'm not, it wasn't me. And I, I totally did not want to see a bunch of fish fly in the sky. That was, that, who would want to see that? Not me. We're halfway there. Next up is the level 50 TNT. This one is called ghost TNT. All right, let's put two of them right up there and let's see what happens. TNT so far. Oh gosh, my eardrums. That was so rude. Let's get a couple more. Oh my gosh, dude. It summons in vexes and gas. Two of the most annoying Minecraft mobs. I have a pretty good idea. We're going to summon in a bunch of spiral TNTs. Let's actually make an entire spiral of spiral TNT. There we go. Now we're talking. I don't think it killed any of the mobs. We're just gonna leave those guys be and we're gonna head over here to this giant building to test out the vaporized TNT. This one has some pretty cool particle effects. I don't know if that actually did anything. We can grab the animal TNT and place that one down so that we have a bunch of mobs and then we can test it out using the vaporized TNT. Let's see if this one actually does something. Uh, uh, okay, all right, hold on, hold on. Can we vaporize the water? Yes, that's what it does. It's like a mega sponge TNT. So that entire area is kind of destroyed. So we're going to bring over the next level of TNT, the air TNT, and we're going to test it out right on top of this giant green bubble. And we're just going to see what happens. And don't worry, it will blow you away. <laughs> It, it, did, it did not blow me away. It blew up an entire chunk up there, but like there wasn't really a lot of damage. So let's try out this one. What? Hold on. Did that just blow up an entire chunk? Hold on. Wait a second. Let's see. Can I get this thing all the way down to bedrock? We're going to try it again. Let's see. Can this thing break through bedrock? It can. Dude, it broke through bedrock. That is pretty impressive. But still not as impressive as the level 100 TNT. The level 60 TNT is called Distraction TNT. I honestly don't know, like, why anybody would use this, but we're gonna find out in about three seconds. Whoa, fireworks. Oh, it's actually super nice. And look, there's like a tiny little explosion there. That was so cool. Oh, I think I understand what it meant by distraction. On to level 65. This beautiful glowing orange TNT is called magma TNT. And if I had to guess, it probably summons in a giant lava pool. Oh, fire and lava. Mm, that's pretty spicy. The level 70 TNT is called end TNT. Let's go test it out on this helicopter. All right, let's plop it down there and let's see what this one does. I saw in chat it summons in shulkers. And that's actually it. It doesn't even summon in any end dimension blocks. It just summons in a bunch of beans surrounded by purple stuff. Where did you guys come from? I do want to test out if the end TNT actually does any damage because it is a TNT to begin with. It actually does. Yeah, it, it, it does a little bit of damage. I have probably the worst idea I've had all day. This is straight out of a nightmare. Just listen to the sounds. <laughs> So that was the level 70 TNT. Next up is level 75, which means that we are getting very close to the level 100 TNT. All right, rainbow TNT. Oh, the particles are beautiful. Look at that, dude. Oh, that is so good. Whoa, wait, this one's something rainbow. Sheep. The rainbow sheep were explosive. That's actually kind of cool. This one would be so funny to troll my friends with, dude. Anyway, let's move on to the level 80 TNT. All right, this one is just called the Illusioner TNT, and it says that it summons in the Illusioner mob. Honestly, the Illusioner mob is probably one of, like, the least thought of mobs. Like, everybody forgets about the Illusioner, but it's also one of the scariest mobs. Look at that. It can literally summon in random things, like it can give itself a bow and arrow, and it can also summon in clones of itself. It's like the Evoker, but it is 10 times more annoying. Have fun with the gravity TNT. That never gets old. That fixed my problem. I believe we are on the level 85 TNT, which is called the Nuke. Oh, this one already has a lag warning. I feel like I have not touched this side of the map, so we're gonna go ahead and change that with the nuclear TNT. Oh, guys, 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 guys. There was, there was a lot of explosion power there. I don't know what happened. Never mind. I know what happened. Everything is gone. Everything is on fire and it got exploded. Look at that, it even went out 
through the lab walls. My computer is on fire right now. I, I literally like everything needs to get reloaded. I can barely move. <laughs> I reloaded the world and look at this, dude. I don't even know where that thing came from. It's like the nuke exploded and then exploded again over there. That honestly looks super cool, but like, look at this. It doesn't want to load in because it knows that I'm going to explode it again. We are officially on level 90 TNT. This one says that it just summons a dragon. There's the dragon TNT. The texture looks awesome. The particle effects even better. And it actually just summons in a dragon. And not one dragon, two dragons, three dragons. Nah, dude, are you Joe four? Four ender dragons? It summons in four? Oh, wait a second. What's the next one? Level 95. <laughs> this one's just wither TNT. There we go. All right. So it's not much of a TNT. More so, it literally just like explodes and then summons in an actual Minecraft boss that's going to explode my entire world. I also do have access to a level 99 TNT, which is called a meteor TNT. I wonder if I could use this to kill the ender dragon. Oh. Oh. Gosh. Oh my goodness. All right. It wasn't as bad as the nuke. Just in case I blow up the entire lab, we're gonna go grab the level 100 TNT. I wonder if I could use the gravity TNT to suck in all of the withers. And then if I could just summon in... No, 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 not magma TNT. We need meteor TNT. There it comes. Oh! It killed all but one of the withers. And it's a good thing I grabbed the level 100 TNT because I'm pretty sure half the lab is gone. One eternity later. So this is what's left of the lab. And there's still one more TNT to test out. The level 100 TNT is called recursion TNT. We're gonna go test it out next to this fake Bessie. Here goes nothing. Three, two, one. Oh, it's summoned in TNT. That summons in more TNT. That summons in more TNT. That summons in more TNT. Guys, my entire screen is filled up with lit TNT. Gosh! Wait, did it actually work? Everything is lagging. Oh, wait a second. There we go. Okay, I'm going to place in five of the level 100 TNTs. Here we go, boys! Oh! 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 That is the most TNT I've ever seen in my entire life. This is a level one sphere TNT. Let's see what it does. What? It just turned everything into part of Minecraft. Oh, I get it, sphere TNT. And now all the blocks are curved like a sphere. How am I supposed to fix this? That TNT just broke my game. Look at my nether portal. It's a circle. Okay, our next god TNT is a level two inverted TNT. Let's see if maybe that'll Uno reverse card everything back to normal. Oh, no, it didn't. It took all of the blocks that were underneath the TNT and just flipped them. What the flip? The next TNT is called Angry Miners. Bessie, where, why did you? Oh, 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 oh my gosh. Wait, they're throwing dynamite. Oh my God, no. Don't do it. We can talk about this. We can be friends. Maybe not. My brain is having trouble comprehending that everything in Minecraft is not cubes. This has happened a couple other times before, and the only way to fix it is to just blow up TNT, and eventually my game will break. What TNT is this? Oh! Bessie just got murked. That is the life of a mad scientist. You create an insane creation, and then it kills you. Let's do that a couple more times. This is called erupting TNT. It just shoots up into the air and then comes crashing down like meteors. Uh, that is sick. The next TNT is called the uh, Chikzulub. I have absolutely no idea what a Chikzulub is, but the picture on it looks like a meteor. <gasps> oh, no way. That just deleted my house and then spawned in a bunch of mini meteors just in case the first time didn't do the job. Yo, since when did I have obsidian underneath my house? Since my house was destroyed, I decided we should probably blow up someplace else. Mr. Iron Golem, you're not gonna like this next TNT. It's called Pillager Outpost TNT. Oh, <laughs> yo, he tried to fight it. We just summoned in an outpost right in the middle of a village. Luckily, our next TNT is pretty convenient. It is called Village Defense TNT, aka VD TNT. TNT. Let's see what this does. Ooh! It just summoned in an army of iron golems. There is an absolute war breaking out right now. We shall celebrate the war with city firework TNT. Ooh, it just shot up into the sky and it's raining down. So... 
What just happened? It just summoned in buildings everywhere. I thought there was going to be fireworks in the air, but it actually just rained down a bunch of TNTs that summoned in villager buildings. Well, now that there's conveniently a city here, we can use our TNT called the Meteor Storm. The TNTs throughout today's video, by the way, are going to get stronger and more destructive. So be sure to stick until the end. Well, that was just one meteor. It took out one. Oh, never mind. There's two meteors. That's actually pretty impressive. Three meteors, four meteors, five meteors, six, seven. Oh my gosh, it is a meteor storm. I don't know if anything is going to survive. Yo, this world just looks so scuffed right now. It's like barely loading in and I could just see all of the different cubes. And for whatever reason, there's like weird ores that actually just stay as blocks. I'm getting stressed out just looking at it. And my computer is already starting to heat up. Wait, that actually looks kind of cool. There's like a circular opening and then just fire in the sky. The fire is dead. Well, I built the city and then I exploded the city like the god that I am. Just in case that wasn't enough, let's try a TNT called the Revolution. Oh, it is just floating up into the sky. Wait, it's summoning him back up. Oh, what just happened? There was like six TNTs that spawned in and then they just shot out and pooped out TNT. There's still a few buildings left, so I decided we should probably summon in junk TNT. Oh my gosh, this looks so cool. There's just, wait, fire everywhere and it actually got rid of the entire junk. Let's do more. So if I just spawn in, a couple. Will it get rid of every single junk in the area? Ooh, it did! Wait, it got rid of all of this area. That's crazy. This is the closest we've had Minecraft looking to vanilla in a while. It actually looks flat. Wait, I lied. Something weird is happening over here. Don't worry. It's something that a little chunk TNT can't take care of. Oh, 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 oh! I think it's done. I've seen a lot of cursed things in today's video, but this might be by far the most cursed thing. This is a desert pyramid. We must explode it with a hexahedron TNT. Oh my God, it is gone. That was perfect. It even spared all the items and the TNT underneath here is still there. Not for long. Let's summon in a Poseidon's Wave TNT. Oh, it's turning nighttime. It's getting dark and spooky. There's some water particle effects coming around Poseidon's Wave TNT and... Is that it? Poseidon is not as strong as I thought he once was. He's supposed to be like the king of the ocean and he spawned in a little puddle and a bunch of squids? Oh, I don't think Poseidon liked that very much. Oh, what just happened? Yo, he turned the entire desert into an ocean. I didn't look at the name of this one, but it looks like a volcano. It is spewing out fire everywhere. Let's see what it does. Oh, oh, it is erupting. Look at all the meteors. Oh, wait, it's spawning in lava too. It probably was not a good idea to do that in the middle of Poseidon's ocean. I think we are slowly breaking Minecraft, ladies and gentlemen. Let's try this one more time. Oh, yes. I wonder why the, oh wait, never mind. The lava is starting to spread now. For whatever reason, that lava is cursed. This lava is normal. There's a random hole down there and it's making me kind of angry. We're gonna test out a TNT called Mankind's Mark. Whoa, okay. Did it just spawn in a village? Was that it? Oh, no, it spawns in like a giant structure. The city fireworks earlier in the video was 10 times better. What's up, Bacon Squad? How's everybody doing today? We're gonna bring you all to heaven with Heaven's Gate TNT. Good luck, guys. Oh, something happened. I heard an explosion. Um, well, all of the bacon has uh died. It's just me and you, donkey. I am extremely confused. Right above me, there is an actual circle. That's supposed to be illegal. It actually just brought that entire chunk down there up into outer space. It actually looks really satisfying when there's no cubes because you look up and it's just a giant circle. And would you look at that? There's another circle. We're up in heaven, so we might as well try out a global disaster. What could go wrong? A lot of things could go wrong. Like my entire sky island could just get deleted. Does it just delete an entire area of blocks? Oh my God. Yes, it does. This entire area just got destroyed. It's just deleted. Look at these chickens falling slowly down. They probably have no clue what just happened. One second they were standing, probably eating some seeds. And then the other second, there was no ground beneath their bodies. Wait, I actually have a really good idea. This next TNT is called Hyperion, which I think... Maybe we'll just spawn a giant tree. Those are also some of the coolest particle effects I've ever seen. It actually looks like a tree. What? I honestly thought that that would spawn in a giant tree and not a bunch of mini trees. How? Wait, what did I? Um, I just fell through bedrock. Guys, this next TNT is a nuclear bomb called the SAR bomb. It should drop out of the sky. Yes. Oh, it deleted the island and it's still falling. Oh, donkey. <laughs> donkey. <laughs>
<laughs> Donkey did not survive the nuclear explosion. It also leaves behind a nuclear waste. It also leaves behind nuclear waste, which I believe we can clear using the clear disaster god TNT. What? I don't think it did anything. Maybe we can clear out the nuclear waste using a mansion god TNT? Oh, wait, that is amazing. This house, I would see myself living in this house. I love that some of the TNTs in today's video aren't all destructive. It comes with a full set of diamond armor and books for knowledge. I don't want any knowledge, so we are gonna use a death ray on this knowledge mansion. That sounds very dangerous and like something bad is about to happen, but at the same time, some of the TNTs are good. But this TNT is charging up a lot. So it seems like there's probably going to be some sort of giant nuclear death ray that comes from the skies from maybe some sort of alien attack. And it doesn't sound like it's gonna be good. It might even be potentially bad. Oh my god! That shot down to the core of the earth and deleted everything! Oh! It just burnt my Minecraft world to a crisp. The only thing left behind was knowledge. Get out of here, knowledge. At the end of today's episode, comment down below your favorite TNT. So far, that's my favorite. Ah, lovely. Another village waiting to be exploded. It would be a real shame if an extinction TNT exploded here. Oh, Mr. Iron. Oh, I was in creative mode. Every Everything died, even me. There was nothing that could have survived that. Since nobody's living here, I guess we can get rid of this poor village that I totally accidentally destroyed and made extinct. Supernova TNT should do the trick. It's currently charging up in a circle. There's lots of fire particles, which are super satisfying to see. And it exploded. My entire game is frozen, which hasn't really happened yet in today's video. I have a feeling I may have crashed my entire computer. No, I didn't, but it should have exploded my computer. This is insane. This was bigger than the death ray TNT. It destroyed every single block except for obsidian and bedrock. I have my render distance on 16 and it can't even fit it all. That might have been the most insane explosion I've ever seen in Minecraft. Oh my god. I don't know how we're gonna top that, but we're gonna try using something called the Helix TNT. Oh, it's spawning in other TNTs. I think that's the Revolution TNT from earlier. And also some more TNTs. There's a lot of TNTs that are floating. Whoa. Oh, it's a sprinkler of TNT. That's insane. Look at it. Wait, it's just raining TNT. It wasn't super destructive, but it did cover an entire area and completely wiped the surface clean. The mansion is still here, so let's try out the unbreakable bedrock TNT. Oh, all right. Well, that just turned everything into bedrock. I still see the Helix TNT going off way in the distance. I think that maybe just sprinkled the entire world with TNT. Doomsday TNT. It looks like a sunflower on the left and then a meteor of death on the right. Let's see what happens. So it made everything start to rain. It's spawning in lots of lightning. It's raining hail. I think it might just be summoning in natural disasters. It honestly seems pretty tame so far. Nothing bad has happened. I hear something charging up though, which is a little bit concerning. Wait, wait, it's spawning in meteors. What is going on? Wait, there's like more and more lightning happening and then the sound just keeps getting bigger. Oh, it's summoned in the death ray. Oh my goodness. That was crazy. Wait a second, it's not stopping stopping either. My entire game just froze again. Oh, please tell me we didn't crash. What just happened? Guys, I think we maybe broke Minecraft. I don't know how my computer didn't explode today. Make sure you guys explode the like button, hit subscribe, it's free, and also check out the brand new merch available over at beckbrojack.co in the description down below.